Hi guys! Welcome back to our YouTube channel. So for today's vlog, we will talk about some gender predictions, yung mga old wives tales. Uh, let's see if tumpak ba siya dun sa result ng aming ultrasound because uh, we already know the gender of our baby. And uh, let's see if uh, some of the old wives tales are correct or not. I'll be using the Haggis uh, gender prediction. So first, are you carrying high or are you carrying low? So let's see if I'm carrying high or low. So this is my bomb. Ayan. That's my bomb, guys. So I think I'm carrying low. They said high means girl. While low means boy. So, one point per boy. Next, do you have pregnancy acne or other types of skin blemishes? Or your skin is glowing and flawless? Since I started this pregnancy, I have pregnancy acne. Ayan. Especially no first trimester ko. May mga blemishes pa ako. Ayan. My face isn't that smooth compared before ako naging pregnant. So they said, acne and other skin blemishes means girl. Old wives tale claims girls will steal your beauty. <laughs> so, and if you're glowing and flawless, it means it's a boy. So since I have acne, uh, it means a girl. So one point per girl, one point per boy. Next, have you noticed a change in your body temperature? Actually, mm, I'm always sweaty. Sobrang init. Even if bukas yung aircon namin, uh, sobrang naiinitan pa din ako. Parang hindi kaya. Nakatawad na yung aircon namin. Kaya lang parang sobrang init. Ayan. Yun yung nararamdaman ko ngayon while I'm pregnant. So they said, if you're feeling cold and icy, it's a boy. Hot and sweaty, it's a girl. So, two points per girl, one point per boy. Next. <laughs> Typically, what is baby's heart rate? So, um, our baby's heart rate is 168 BPM. Uh, they said, slower heart rates means boy, while heart rates over 140 means girl. So, since our baby's heart rate is 160, so it's over 140, they said it's a girl. So, how many points per girl already? Three points per girl, one point per boy. <laughs> Next, have you noticed any significant cravings? So, since I got pregnant, sobrang gusto ko yung maaala at saka yung maaasin. Pero... Uh, we know watch ko rin yung intake ko ng salty foods kasi pregnant women is very prone sa UTI so I'm kind of watching my ano salt intake kanya yung mga salt na nilalagay ko sa pagkain ayan so yun we know watch ko siya they said if you're craving sweet things you're having a girl <laughs> if you're craving salty or sour foods it's a boy so uh, 2 points per boy 3 points per girl next both ancient Chinese and Mayan culture use the calendar to predict baby's gender. If both your age and the year you conceive are even, you're having a girl. Same if they're both odd. If one is even and one is odd, you're having a boy. So we found out I was pregnant April. Birthday ko kasi is May. But pasok pa siya sa... 25 years old, year conceived 2020, so it means it's a boy. Uh, there's a tie, three, three points per girl, three points per boy. <laughs> Have you dealt with morning sickness? Ayan, so, naka-experience ako ng morning sickness and it's not a joke, it's super mahirap. So they said, morning sickness means it's a girl. If not, then it's a boy. So one point again for girl. <laughs> Four points per girl, three points per boy. Next, we all know that sympathy pains are a real thing. If your husband put on some baby weight, an old wife's tale says it's a girl. If not, it's a boy. So, si Patrick, hindi siya nag-gain ng weight. <laughs> Same pa din ang kanyang weight. 
So, one point again for boy. Next, have you experienced lots of clumsiness during your pregnancy? Actually, sobrang clumsy ko ngayon. Sobrang minsan nakakatakot bumaba ng hagdan kasi uh, there was a time na, na ka, kamuntikan na ako malaglag sa hagdanan. Ayan, sobrang clumsy. So, they said, if, if you're clumsy, it's a boy. If you've been graceful, expect a baby girl. So, one point for boy naman. <laughs> Have you experienced frequent headaches during your pregnancy? Yes, I'm experiencing headaches. Grabe, sobrang sakit. Minsan gusto ko nalang matulog, ganyan. Kasi ayaw ko uminom ng kahit anong gamot. So, they said, if yes, it's a boy. If no, it's a girl. So, one point again for boy. <laughs> What color is your pee? So, pati pala ang color ng pee. <laughs> so, they said, if your urine is bright yellow, it's a boy. If your urine is light or dull in color, it's a girl. So, my pee color is kind of dull and light. So, it means it's a girl. <laughs> and last one. How is your mood? If you're happy or mellow, expect a boy. If you're moody, it's a girl. So, uh, right now, sobrang happy ko. Hindi ako moody or something. Happy lang, ganyan. <laughs> Hindi ako stressed or something. Um, happy. I'm really happy. There's no room for moodiness or something. So, yon They said, if you're happy or mellow, expect a boy. If you're moody, it's a girl. So, one point again for boy. So now, let's count how many points for girl and how many points for boy. <laughs> so for girl, we have 5 points. And for boy, we have 7 points. So lamang ang boy kesa sa girl. So watch out kasi uh, we were planning to have like a gender reveal. <laughs> That's all for today. Thank you for watching, guys. Bye!